In the previous video clip, we explained to you how the Reserve Bank can use open market operations to influence the size of the money market deficit. In this video clip, we are going to explain the second instrument that the Reserve Bank has available, and that is to transfer money from the tax and loan account to the Reserve Bank. Right, now let me first explain to you what a tax and loan account is. The government holds accounts with each of the four commercial banks, with each of the four large commercial banks in South Africa. So each of the four large commercial banks will have a government account with them. And then the government also holds an account with the Reserve Bank. Now these accounts that the government holds with the commercial banks, they are called tax and loan accounts. Right. Now, when the Reserve Bank wants to increase the size of the money market deficit using tax and loan accounts, it can simply transfer money from those tax and loan accounts to the government's account with the Reserve Bank. And th because that money is not available to the banks any longer, it will mean that the liquidity deficit of the banks or the money market deficit will increase. So it's money that flows from the banks to the Reserve Bank, the liquidity deficit will increase. Right, but similarly, the Reserve Bank can also use tax and loan accounts when it wants to decrease the size of the liquidity deficit of the banks. So all it will do then is to transfer money from the government's account with the Reserve Bank to these tax and loan accounts with the commercial banks money flows back to the banks and therefore the liquidity deficit of the banks will decrease. Um, when will the Reserve Bank do this? We've said in the previous video clips that the Reserve Bank actually wants to create a money market deficit. But sometimes it wants to make them money market deficit or the liquidity deficit of the bank smaller and that might be for instance at the end of the month when banks need much more cash because everyone is withdrawing their cash to pay bills or to pay wages so in that case the reserve bank will then use tax and loan accounts or open market operations whichever to decrease the size of the liquidity deficit, in other words, to increase the amount of cash available to the banks.